The League of German Girls, Bund Deutsche Madel, BDM, played a crucial role in the indoctrination of young German girls into the beliefs and ideals of the Nazi regime. This video will delve into the history and purpose of the BDM, exploring its development, activities, and the role it played in shaping the future of young girls in Nazi Germany. The Formation of the BDM The BDM had its roots in the early 1920s when localized girls' groups were established by Gustav Adolf Lenk. However, these early groups struggled to gain membership and mainly focused on promoting anti-Semitic interpretations of folklore, language, and history. It was only in 1926, with the establishment of the Hitler Youth by Kurt Grubber, that a dedicated department for young women, led by Helen Kunald and Anna Bauer, was created. Despite recruitment efforts, these groups still face challenges in gaining widespread support. On July 7, 1932, Balda von Skyrock and Gregor Strasser dissolved other Nazi girls' groups, consolidating their memberships into the BDM. By the end of 1932, membership was estimated to be between 10,000 to 15,000 girls. The BDM gained momentum after the Nazi rise to power, with non-Nazi girls' groups being dissolved and the BDM's inclusion in Nazi propaganda campaigns. The Role and Indoctrination of BDM Members the primary purpose of the BDM was to indoctrinate young girls into Nazi ideals, emphasizing their role as future mothers of the Third Reich. To achieve this, the BDM introduced the Belief and Beauty Society, a voluntary group for girls aged 17 to 21. The society focused on activities such as cooking, sewing, education, and politics, all in alignment with Nazi ideology. Members also engaged in home help, store and office assistance, health service support, and troop activities. Under the leadership of Uta Rudiger from 1942, the BDM expanded its reach, aiming to have all members eventually transfer over to the women's wing of the Nazi party, led by Gertrud Schultz Klink. Thousands of girls were part of the BDM by 1941, giving the organization a significant influence in indoctrinating young girls into Nazi beliefs. Promoting conformity and obedience The BDM played a crucial role in ensuring its members conformed to Nazi ideals. It encouraged girls to select appropriate partners to start families, emphasizing good health and an acceptable racial background in line with Nazi racial theory. Former BDM members were expected to raise their children in accordance with Nazi ideals, perpetuating these beliefs for future generations. The BDM's activities were designed to prepare children for their roles as future mothers and fathers, aligning with the curriculum taught in schools where all lessons were tailored to Nazi interpretations of history, biology, and geography. The organization also encouraged young women to participate in household and agricultural activities, supporting the ideal of strong, healthy girls fit for childbearing. Sports and uniforms in the BDM Sports played a significant role in the BDM, with a focus on creating healthy, strong girls capable of bearing multiple children. Activities included swimming, gymnastics, running, and athletics. However, there was tension within the organization about striking a balance between raising healthy young women and avoiding excessive masculinization through sports. The BDM uniform, characterized by dark blue skirts, brown jackets, black neckerchiefs, and white blouses, aimed to foster conformity and unity among members. Modifications to the uniform were not allowed, and the use of makeup or cosmetics was discouraged. The BDM's role during World War II During World War II, the BDM played various roles within society. They ran camps for schoolgirls evacuated from major cities, aided with the harvest in rural areas and helped those in urban areas affected by Allied bombing. BDM girls also assisted members of the Hitler Youth with anti-aircraft defenses, and served in the Signal Corps of the Women's Section of the SS. They were trained as volunteer nurses on the front line, helping move injured soldiers and volunteering in local branches of Nazi offices. Conclusion The League of German Girls, a vital component of the Hitler Youth, played a significant role in indoctrinating young German girls into the ideals of the Nazi regime. By promoting conformity, obedience, 
and loyalty to Nazi beliefs. The BDM aimed to shape the next generation of mothers and fathers in line with Nazi ideology. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and share it. Your support is greatly appreciated, and you can find details on how to support my channels through PayPal and Patreon in the description box below.